For the purpose of this video, we'll be demonstrating the installation on a socketed charge point. Loosen the two enclosure screws with a 4mm Allen key. Remove the front cover. On a tethered charge point, please disconnect the coloured connectors to release the front cover. Please make sure to reconnect these once the installation process is complete. With the front cover removed, you can now see the pre-drilled 25mm supply cable hole. The stand for the cable grip. The embedded spirit level. The fixing position and clamp to the incoming power connector. A 25mm drill out point when supplying the charger from the rear. Please ensure to use the supplied 25mm grommet when using this form of entry. And the four fixing points for mounting the enclosure to the wall. Install the compression gland and lock ring then tighten. Use the fixing template to mark the holes for drilling. Secure the enclosure to the mounting surface using appropriate screws and fixings. Insert the supply cable, then install the cable grip. Install the incoming power connector. If you are not installing dynamic load management, please continue to the next step. If you are installing dynamic load management, terminate the two cables into the connection terminals. Mount incoming and outgoing power connectors into the enclosure. Reattach the front cover using the 4mm hex screws. Please don't fit the trim until the device has been fully tested and commissioned. 